Hello, this is Alicia from Wild Birds Unlimited of Chapel Hill. My videographer has the day off, so I'm recording this myself. This is our birdhouse setup, our advanced pole system birdhouse setup. Let me go through what that setup includes. First, we have our six foot pole that is going to auger into the ground. One foot, we've already pre-marked that for you with white paint so you'll know you've gone one foot into the ground. It easily augers into the ground using a screwdriver. So there's the, um, the hole that runs all the way through the pole that's going to allow you to put your screwdriver through there and crank this pole into the ground one foot. This is the flange or flange that attaches to the back of your box and then to the pole with this thumb screw. What that does is it allows you, let's go back up here, it allows you to adjust the height of your nest box on your pole system so it's easy for you to uh, monitor the box. So here's the door of the box. I can easily reach that, open it up for cleaning it out. Um, then the other piece is the baffle. And how does the baffle attach to the pole? With this baffle collar that you see here. Again, it attaches to the pole with a thumb screw. And you're just gonna put your nest box on there mark with a pencil or something the bottom of the box take your box back off because you'll have to to put the baffle on place this baffle collar about an inch below the mark where your box will go and then the baffle itself has a hole in it it's just going to slide right over the pole and sit on top of the baffle collar so you can't see the baffle collar that's what's holding this baffle up and let's take a closer look now at our Eco Tough Bluebird house. So we have it in taupe. We also have it in blue and white. Some say that's Carolina blue. That's just a coincidence. Let's take a look at why we love this box so much. My favorite part about this box is that it opens from the top. And so you could quickly monitor the box by opening it from the top and give it a quick peek and close it back. Mama's gonna probably stay on the nest. If not, she'll just fly out through that hole. Um, but your the nest is safe, the eggs are safe. You can see there's a fledgling ladder inside the box. You can still open the box from the side to clean out, so you just twist that. This is easier to do with two hands. Hold on. There we go. So that opens up for cleaning out. Um, this box has ventilation, so you can see the cutouts there. So you've got ventilation and also on the bottom, the corners are cut out for drainage, which is really important. And of course, this house has been uh, made to spec for the Eastern Bluebird, so you've got the one and a half inch opening here. That doesn't mean that only bluebirds can use the box. Any of the smaller cavity nesting birds, when it's placed in the right spot, can use it. That would be chickadees, titmice, wrens, and nuthatches in our area. You might even find that you have downy woodpeckers roosting in there in the winter. Um, so anyhow, that is our nest box setup, our advanced pole system nest box setup with our EcoTuff Bluebird nest box. Again, it comes in taupe, but also blue and white.